Samsung has made a major shift in its latest software update, One UI 8. According to reports, the ability to unlock the bootloader has been completely removed across all devices running One UI 8, including both beta and stable builds. This decision affects several popular models like the Galaxy S25, S25 Ultra, Galaxy Z Fold 7, and others. For advanced users, unlocking the bootloader is essential for installing custom ROMs, rooting devices, or modifying the system at a deeper level. With this feature now missing, users are restricted to Samsung's default software experience. Interestingly, users have also noticed that even if their device's bootloader was already unlocked, updating to One UI the 8th of May automatically relock it. This issue has been spotted on internal test builds for devices such as the Galaxy S23 Ultra and Galaxy S22 Ultra. According to TechLeak Zone, the bootloader unlock toggle has been entirely removed from the developer options menu, sparking frustration among Android power users who value device customization. Samsung has not officially commented on the change, but speculation suggests it may be a move to boost device security or comply with carrier policies. Regardless, this decision is being seen as a step back for user freedom. More updates are expected soon. One such leak involves a test version of One UI 8 running on the Galaxy Z Fold 6, giving us a first glimpse at what the update may bring. From what we've seen so far, One UI 8 appears to be more of a refinement than a reinvention. One UI 8 acts as a substitute for One UI 7.1. Based on leaked images and reports, One UI 8 closely resembles One UI 7 in terms of visuals, at least in its current stage. Whether Samsung plans any major design changes later remains unclear. Given that One UI 7 introduced significant UI redesigns, it's unlikely that One UI 8 will follow with drastic visual overhauls. However, subtle improvements are being spotted, particularly in native apps like Gallery and File Manager, where the layout and option placement now seem better organized. Perhaps the most exciting part of this leak is the appearance of the Now Brief feature on older devices. So far, this AI-powered card-based summary feed has been exclusive to the Galaxy S25 series, and it never made its way to the Galaxy S24 lineup via One UI 7. Interestingly, Now Brief is included in the One UI 7-based test firmware version F956BX6U2CYD7 on the Galaxy Z Fold 6. While it's still early in development, we expect Samsung to make more changes before the final release. Due to delays with One UI 7, Samsung never launched a One UI 7.1 version. That's why One UI 8 is shaping up to serve as both the next Android upgrade and the refinement update users usually expect in mid-cycle releases.